Industry Labs, what up, Banks? <laughs> I'm glad you're in the building. I'm glad you're in the building. Ain't we working hard? Ain't we working hard? I can't have you working, uh, Banks, because I just said I built this shit brick by brick. <laughs> built this shit brick by brick. Pretty gangster, what up? You've been inactive all day, pretty gangster. <laughs> oh man, Marcy May, Marcy May. Shout out to everybody in Marcy May, man. Um, like I said, man, you see that last post, I built that shit brick by brick. That shit kinda fit into that last post by Emery that I, you know, reposted by Emery about changing the narrative about everything with my story. Um, yo, shout out to everybody that went and watched Marcy May just behind that last post, man. I appreciate it. And you know what I'm saying? The conversations I had in the DM for people that didn't really know the story. You know what I'm saying? Now you got a, a, a better perspective on things, on you know how I feel and how the story is. So shout out to everybody that's been supporting Marcy Made and the people that went and watched it um, to give some clarity to what's going on with this, uh, with my story. And, um, you know, that support is really, <laughs> man, you don't even know, bro. Um, as y'all see, man, since I built Marcy Made, since we've been going on, like, we really have not asked for any donations and, you know, asked for PayPals and all that shit, man. We really done this shit brick by brick, man. And, um, the last time we asked for $2 million, you know what I'm saying? It, it wasn't there. We wanted $2 million to get Marcy May done. You know what I'm saying? And people laughed and shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, but at the end of the day... <laughs> We still got Marcy made done, and it's going to do way more than what we asked for. So you know, it's a it's a blessing. And some things sometimes it don't work out. You know, the way you see everybody else situations works out. So I appreciate y'all for even still supporting Marcy made, sharing Marcy made. Um, it's a lot of great things happening right now, man. Um, God asked me not to share everything, so I got to hold some things because it's a lot of, as you can see, it's hate going on, you know what I'm saying? And people really, it really is hate. Um, and they not disguising it, you feel me? Um, especially with my story. And, and it's funny, one of the comments said, yo, your story is like one of the Chicago, Chicago Bulls championship picture without Michael Jordan in there. You feel what I'm saying? Like, the Chicago Bulls without Michael Jordan in this picture. You know what I mean? Um, I don't know if you saw the story, but, you know, that's where I feel like where my position was and the, the foundation of everything that's going on, you know, with Rockefeller and all that shit. So, you know, and people would look at that picture and be like, yo, well, where's Jordan at? And everybody on the Chicago Bulls is telling their story and telling their story, but nobody is, is talking about joy and shit, you know what I'm saying? So it's got the outside, you know, people like, yo, what's going on here? You feel me? So that's pretty much like how things, you know, how they changing the story up, you know, and another generation would see that picture and would just think that's the Chicago Bulls. You feel what I'm saying? When that's not the exact story, when Somebody older would be like, nah, 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 that ain't the, that ain't the team. That ain't who really put the team together. That ain't who really won the championships and shit that made it happen. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, when you think about it, think about it in that point. And that was a good perspective somebody DM'd me at. You know? um, and that's, I thought that was cool. But other than that, man, I appreciate it, man. And when I say, like I said, brick by brick, man, like, during the course of this Marcy Me, man, I don't, I met some great people I lost some great people I made some terrible decisions I made some good decisions you know what I'm saying the, the whole journey um, and it's gonna be like <laughs> it's gonna be like 
amazing to actually start filming it. You know what I'm saying? Um, that's what you know. That's what the bigger goal is. But I pre like I said, I came on. You know, I appreciate it. I ain't come on here to antagonize that. And I don't want people to think that when I come on here that I really I'm hating these guys and I'm throwing. You know, because technically, if you really look at it, it's like. You know what I'm saying? When they do it like that, it's like they sh they throwing shots at you. They throwing shots at you. So, you know what I'm saying? It it's like, damn, you throwing shots and shit. I'm really trying to tell my story here. And, you, you know, you, you you carrying me in a different way. You carrying me in a different way. And this is not how I'm writing my story. You feel what I'm saying? And everybody got their story. And I ain't saying, you know, you don't have your story. But, you know what I'm saying? When it, when it affects minds and my... uh reality of my, my story, how real it is, you know what I'm saying? It's affecting the whole shit. So, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be, um, it's going to be, uh, confusion. It, it, just like it's, it's confusion w with Biggie movie and, and certain people that wasn't a part of that. It's confusion with a lot of movies that, and, and stuff that people that was there wasn't affiliated that should have had some say in it. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, it is what it is. Other than that, though, I ain't, I ain't on no hate and shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm just telling my story. And it's too much hate and shit going on, yo. Like, I don't want to spew into this, but the world right now ain't for that right now. I, I don't know how to explain it, but I ain't got that in me, no hate. It's not even a good time for that right now with what's going on in this world. Um... So I ain't, I ain't trying to practice preach hate and shit like that. But when you see it, you know, you call the spade a spade. Um, and I want to say, uh, you guys, uh, if you're not tuned in to OG Certified yet, man, you should got, you should be over there. You know what I'm saying? Um, um, OG Certified, you should be over there getting over uh, that platform that I have over there. Cause that's about to be dope. I'm about to have some deep conversations over there about things, about what's going on right now in this world, in my perspective. Um, Cause it's sad, you know what I'm saying? It's sad that a nigga can't really celebrate and be happy because of what's going on in the world. You get what I'm saying? Like, and I've just, you know, I've been told like, yo, you, you gotta stop worried about other people, worried about people, be happy for yourself, be be, ha be happy for yourself. You know what I'm saying? I ain't saying that's a selfish statement for that somebody made, but for me, it's just hard. It's like, how could you be happy and, and celebrate and enjoy it if your circle and your people and your foundation around you is not, and your world is not, like everything around you is not. I don't even care oh, at any level. Like, if you just stop and look around now, like, you just, you just can't be happy right now. I don't understand. If you could be, if you know, you could be happy with the things you got, but just looking around you right now, shit, you can't enjoy this shit, man. Um, my condolence to those in Buffalo, man, sad. My condolence to all of these people in violence, sad, man, and... We gonna talk about it on OG Certified, like I said, man. Go over there to that platform I got going on over there. I suggest you if you really wanna talk about some serious, some good issues and some serious politics and some, you know, good energy vibes and connections and resources over there. Other than that, man, you know, you know, it's, it's just hard, man. Like how to, you know, share share your happiness in the world, like what's going on today. And I want you to know when you over here, Marcy Made, man, and like, you know, it's been through, Marcy Made been through a lot. If you will go through comments from years ago up until now, where we, we, you know, where we at now with the turn of perspectives on my story, you know what I'm saying? Now, now that people are seeing and hearing me more and more. But there's no hate there no more. There's no hate there. People just want to see, and I, and, I, and I campaign see me win. Shout out to Silent Kings. Y'all already know I'm still repping this. Um, Y'all already seen that campaign, see me win, see me win. You know what I'm saying? When <laughs> when I see comments on my page, man, salute to me. And when I, people walk up to me in the street, you know what I'm saying? I'm winning. You know what I'm saying? I'm winning. And, and this ain't got nothing to do with me uh, money. 
than nothing. I'm winning. Like when I walk up and get things on the strength and people respect me, I'm winning. Like that's what I wanted to do. See me win. Like there ain't no hate over here. And that's what Marcy made is looking like over there. If you look at the comments. So shout out to that, man. Shout out to the new connections I met, yo. Um, Texas, man. Um, it's going to be, uh, it's, it's, we got some things going on. It's going to be good. So shout out to the new family in Texas I, I got, man. Um, it's about to get much more bigger. Shout out to Industry Labs, P, uh, Pretty Gangster, everybody else, everybody else behind the scenes, man. Like I said, there's a lot of people attached to Marcy Main. A lot of people attached to Marcy Main um, that's behind the scenes. Um, I got day ones behind the scenes that haven't even been, haven't showed their face, haven't said nothing, or, you know, that you don't know about, but you will see man, how big the family of Marcy Maid is. Um, but we are working hard. I'm saying, and, it, and it's paying off, man. God is good. Um, but I just had to come on and let you know about that last post, man, and what it meant, man. There's no hate. And like I said, and thank y'all for the support on Marcy Main and keep sharing it. Um, and that's it. Don't forget. Do not forget. OG certified. Because I think I'm about to, uh, about while I'm vibing now, I'm about to tune in over there. You know what I'm saying? Talk about some other, this, this, this other issue with Buffalo and the killings and the streets and shit. You know, we about to go into something over there. So if you ain't over there, you know what I'm saying? Uh, come on over there for some late night wrap up rap. You know what I'm saying? Um, I ain't watching no awards. I ain't doing none of that. This social media um, uh, the content is, is like, it ain't helping. It ain't helping. You know what I'm saying? Uh, rest in peace to m to the homie, man, we lost one out in Baltimore. Um, you know what I mean? Like I said, man, this world, man, I think it just need to stop the world and reset. You know what I'm saying? Stop the world and reset. Ice, what up? Coleon. Um, Like I said, shout out Marcy May. Shout out everybody else, man, that supports North Carolina all the way down the board in I-95. Um, Atlanta, I'm coming. Shout out to Castro, man, doing this thing out in Atlanta, man. I can't wait to get out there and see you and meet you, bro. This is going to be hype. And um, everything else, man. I'm going to let y'all go tonight, man. I hope you have a good Sunday. But like I said, if you ain't doing nothing, come on over to Marcy, uh, OG Certified and holla at me. Let's wrap over there. Peace and I'm out. Don't forget, share Marcy made, man. Keep watching that, man. Keep watching that. Um... Like I said, it's been all love, and I appreciate the support. Yeah.